with um, quite a lot of applications and some games it's really useful to be able to save your state of play. Um, Scrabble is an example of this. Now there's a number of ways that you can deal with this on the next. Obviously the easiest one is just to snapshot the game at the point that you're at and you can always return to that and with the masses of space on an SD card it's not like the old days where you had a microdrive cartridge to snapshot to you've got loads of space and you can have to have loads of snapshots but that's not really how the game was designed it was designed for you to um, load from tape now the other thing you can do which is great with the um, next is you could simply set up a tape to load from in a tap form which comes off your SD card you have to do what I've just done now you change the import to the tape that you've got your um, in this case Scrabble boards on um, and then if you just go back into your Scrabble um, you can load your board file I actually called it one for simplicity and there we have we have a, a previous one so using tap in and tap out uh, uses the program much as it was intended to with the tape save being diverted to a tap however there is a third way you can do this which I'm going to show you now which um, is even more direct for the alternative option of saving your board game state I'm now going to load Scrabble into Spectrum Next mode. N for Next. Scrabble runs as you'd expect it to. And I can now load a saved game by simply putting C colon in front of the name. And there we are. All I had to do is to remember to put C colon in front of the name when I saved it. You can do exactly the same thing with a number of other of the older programs too. For example, here's Tasword 2 loaded into Next. Now, if I go into the load file command and again C colon and then the name of the file let's do uh, the tutor there it is and that works in reverse for saving as well VU file is another program you can do this with and particularly useful uh, with a database. Uh, just to show you, um, I've saved a file which is um, actually one of the examples C colon world as C colon world. I can load it back by simply doing C colon world it's very quickly read it off the SD card and I can now see it there. Here is a, another example. Um, this is VU Calc and in the same way you can load your spreadsheet. So just go into load mode and then I will do a C colon and the name of the file and quickly as that it loads directly from the SD card. 